Okay guys, this is a review of the SentrySafe SFW123 UTC. Uh, what we've got here is a, one of the smaller safes, still quite generous in uh, size. Um, it's got a touch panel on the front, it takes four AAA batteries. I'll show you where those batteries go in a minute. And it's got a separate lock here. What this lock does, these don't work independently. This lock, uh, even if you know the five digit code to get into the safe, if this lock is engaged, you still not can you still can't get in. So it basically acts as a second means to uh, lock the safe. Let's go ahead and put the five-digit code in. It says proceed. Turn the handle. You can see here it's got four heavy-duty bolts that uh, keep the safe securely closed. I'll just show you those, like so. You can see they're pretty pretty substantial. Um, as I say, it's one of the smaller safes, it's still got plenty of storage. I've got a, a handgun in here, a little storage tray in here. Let's go ahead and take the handgun out. And you can see in this little bay here, you pop the cover off, and put the four uh, AAA batteries inside there. It's got a single shelf, uh, is adjustable in height. So you can go ahead, take that out, move it to a different desired place, like so. Very heavy duty pin on here. If somebody were to try to uh, force entry, the safe does come with a, an alarm that you can choose to enable or disable. Um, let's go ahead and get these bolts back in. I put in the code in. And what you can see is when you first open the safe, there's two little LEDs on the side here that provide some extra illumination into the safe so good if it's dark or the lighting is poor so I'm going to show you how the extra key lockout works let's go ahead and lock the safe and you remember all I had to do was type my five digit code to get into the safe so I'm going to take the one of the uh, supplied two keys and I'm going to go ahead and lock this now even if I know the code it says proceed I cannot get in so this acts as a, a separate, uh, uh, an additional means to secure the safe. So even if somebody were to know the code, without this, they're not going to be able to get in. Let's go ahead and unlock that. Type the code. Oops, I've got the code wrong. See, it actually flashes error there. Let's go ahead and type the code correctly. So, and there you go, nice little safe.